Hello, everybody. I am angry. No, wait, I mean, I'm Kirby1917, and I'm angry. In fact, I'm just so angry, Er, I just punch out a rock. Er, stupid rock, causing all my problems. You're bane in my freaking existence. Ah! 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 Ah, I felt good. Alright, I feel a little better. But yeah. Uh, my my week well the past two weeks kinda sucked actually. So I don't know, I thought I'd talk about it for some random reason. I don't know why. I don't know why I would need to feel the need to say anything. But you know any excuse I can get for uh playing Minecraft, I'll take it. So uh hold on. Before we get to that show you something I made. It's pretty cool. Yes, and, it's, and it still works. I'm glad that it still works. Um, I found a cave system over there. So in order to get to it, I have set up an elaborate taxi system. Pig, get out of here! You are not allowed on my taxi system. Here we go, here we go. There we go. You just simply ride it down past a beautiful scenic point of burnt forest and non-burnt forest and you simply get off here and everything's fine and it does a, con a continual loop like that for pretty much forever use a little booster track over here to push it forward and it uses the momentum from this to get up that ramp Crap, now it's getting dark. Anyway, and it comes back all the time. So I like that. But, uh, anyway, that's, uh, not what I was gonna talk about. I'm gonna go exploring while I talk about my troubles this week. So, uh, anyway, let's start from the very, from about two weeks ago. Sir, that sounds about right. Um,. So about two weeks ago, on February 3rd, it was, that was a Thursday, I believe, it was Chinese New Year, uh, because of the Chinese, oh my god, pig, get out of the way, there you go, don't you mess with me, pig, uh, I don't want that pig to, to get caught in the minecart, whatever, anyway, so February 3rd was Chinese New Year, so what, me and my friends did is that we went over to uh, we went over to a, a Chinese the Chinese club we had at our school was holding a party of sorts for the Chinese New Year and it was free for anybody to attend so we all went in I mean obviously there's free food there so who's gonna argue with free food right anyway so yeah that was one of the main reasons why we went there I had no ulterior motives for going there. Nope. No ulterior motives for going to the Chinese club. Nope. None at all. Hint, hint. Anyway. So, when they brought out the food, the worst thing in the world could have possibly happened to me. I started having, having uh, stomach pains. Yeah. I started having stomach pains for something I ate before. And, uh, I was not happy at all. Because there was delicious free food that was, like, right behind me. But I couldn't eat. I could barely eat any of it, as in I tried. But my stomach was hurting way too much. Oh, come on, lag. It's all this fire that's making me lag. I really need to learn to control my flint and tinder usage. Anyway, but yeah... That was one of the first things that sucked, is that they had all this good free food. But, uh, my stomach was, uh, too inca incapacitated at the moment to really do anything about it. Why aren't you on fire? That's weird. Anyway. So, uh, that was the first thing that sucked about the week. Um... 
Okay, so then let's see here. What else? Um, what else? Alright, so the second thing that I really hated about the week was that during that the same week of two weeks ago, if you follow me, of course, if you follow what I'm getting at, was that, um, in our English class, we had to review these papers that were done by other students. And, uh, I'm the only one who does anything in that English class at all. As an assistant English 2 class, so it's one of those classes that people have to take. So, if people have to take it, they're not really going to give it much scrap. As in, it's one of those classes you have to take no matter what major you are. As in, it doesn't matter if you're computer science, information technology, or uh, even a history major. It's one of those classes you just kind of have to take in order to graduate. So, English 2 is one of those classes where, of course, you had to graduate from. Or, I mean, uh, you had to pass in order to continue on. And, uh, the people in my class, they don't give a crap about anything. They don't, they don't give a crap. They... Ooh, what's this over here? It's like a mass suicide of chickens, pigs, and cows happened here. That's kind of weird. So collect the remains. But yeah, everyone in my English class are pretty much... I don't want to say idiots, but they're really, really lazy. Oh, this is where that lava is. I wonder where that was. Huh. It's pretty cool to find lava just sitting out here in the open like that. I'll probably have to dig down here one day. So you can find any diamonds. We don't already have a diamond sword. But anyway. Like I was saying. Since the people in our English class are so lazy. When we have a paper due. They don't give a crap out what it, what it is. So, when we have to review our, uh, each other's papers, I get stuck with this one person paper who does nothing. He, the person literally to summarize the entire story. It's something you would expect out of, oh, I don't know, maybe someone in middle school. Even elementary school, maybe. But, I don't know. Do elementary people in elementary school have to write papers? I don't, I don't think they do. That's odd. Why is there sulfur here? I'm definitely on peaceful. I don't know why there's sulfur here. Because I don't feel like getting attacked by monsters while I talk, that's why. Anyway, but yeah, the person I had to look over... Shut up, seep. Is that a creeper? Oh, that's a plant. But yeah, people are just so lazy that they don't even care what they're doing. That really pisses me off. That when you have something as easy to do as a simple paper, what do they do? They just summarize the entire story, not even care about what the assignment's about. Ah. Oh, I swear. People, man, people. Anyway, let's see here. Let's, let's move away from that subject. To, uh... Talk about... Um, something that happens less with students, but more with the school itself. The third thing that happened to me was actually last Tuesday, I believe. Um, oh wow. Can't believe the forest this far didn't get burned down. Let's see. Yeah, because pretty much the line of trees gets cut off right here, so the fire wouldn't be able to spread to these trees. It's uh, pretty close right here, but uh, I guess not enough. So anyway, this past Tuesday of last week, our water, our water supply, you know, the water that comes out of your sinks and out of the bathtub, you know, just in case you're confused of any other type of water you may have thought of. But yeah, the water to our dorms got cut off. That's where I came from, so... Oh, this way. So we were stuck... For a whole night... Without water. We had no water coming from the sinks. And no water to take a sour with. So, a lot of people were pretty pissed at that. Including me, because I couldn't brush my teeth. I couldn't take a sour for the class my 
the next morning. And it just overall sucked. Luckily, the class was cancelled, so... And it was fixed the next morning. But, you know, it's just a fact that, uh... The water got cut off. <laughs> uh, I swear, this school, sometimes. Cutting off our water supply, man. What do we do to deserve this hatred? Oh, is it already dawn already? That night just seemed long. Ooh, mushrooms. So let's go collect these mushrooms. Even though they look gross as crap. Um, what else? All right, well, there's only one final thing that kind of pissed me off this week. It was the fact that uh, I went on this Minecraft server. It was a free to get on, and like anybody could go on there. It was called MinecraftServer.com, so it wasn't hard to figure out the name or remember it for that matter. Ooh, a cave. Um, I'll come back there in a second. So yeah, it was called Minecraft's. It was called MinecraftServer.com. I went there. It was pretty cool playing with a lot of other people, seeing what other people created. But, uh, I was eventually visited by two very, uh, how should I say this? By two very seemingly innocent guys, as in, they just kind of popped up out of nowhere and was like, Hi there, we're just looking around. I'm like, okay, whatever. And they seemed innocent enough, but I could swear I could, could detect the sarcasm in their voice from just their typing. So later, they randomly started killing me for no reason. And I was like, dude, why would you do this to me? I have done nothing to you. And you're like, we're bored. I like, really, you're bored. And that's reason to kill someone and have and take all their stuff. So that really pissed me off. Ooh, wait a second. That's what I thought. Uh, this cave was a disappoint. Cave, I am disappoint. Let's go look at the other cave I found. But yeah, just... People, I guess the term is called griefing. I never knew about that term, but apparently it's been around since, like, forever. Griefing, causing so many grief. It pretty fits the situation. Except I didn't really care. I mean, it was just a game. And it's not like I was like, Dude, how could you? I'm crying over here. No. I was mad about it, of course. Of course I was mad. Oh, whoops. I had a little underground uh, spring here. Which does nothing. Alright. But yeah, they were griefing all over the place. And they were killing other people, as I came to understand also. And uh, one of the guys got banned. And his partner was pretty mad about that. But I was laughing. So, which made him to come over and burn down my house. Because I built it all out of logs to make it kind of look like a log cabin. But yeah, he definitely came over and burnt down my house. So that when I logged back in the next time, it was all gone. Except for like the front door and... uh The front door and... Uh, Pretty much, that was it. Like, after everything else had been, was burned down to the ground. So that really pissed me off. Like, that took me a while to get the materials to build that. And, uh... Yeah. Let's see here. Let's continue following this path. Hmm. Yeah, that was, that's about it. Not much of an update video at all. It's just kind of a rant video. A rant using the world of Minecraft. Carry on, Minecraft man. Take my troubles away. Hmm, what's this? Uh, how long have I been recording this for? I really should have kept track. Ooh, what's. Nah, that's nothing there. Alright, so, uh. 
Looks like that's about it for what was tr causing me trouble. Yeah, I know it wasn't that much. But just those little things that build up over time can really make a person pretty mad. So, yeah, that's that's about it. Why aren't I stop playing? I can't stop playing this game. Oh my god. Fwah! Oh, I landed safely. I thought I was going to get hurt, at least. Even though this is peaceful mode, you can still get hurt. But, uh, you do, but you just get your HP back instantly. So I guess you can still die on peaceful mode. If you take, like, a jump from, like, all the way up there. Uh, let's see here. It looks like a cave over there. I'll walk that way and explore that cave for a little bit. And I'll turn off the video. The last video I did with Minecraft was pretty bad, considering not the video itself, but the way I rendered it out. I really hated that, because, uh, Sony Vegas did not want to cooperate with me. Shut up, cow. cow. So you get for back-talking me. You want some? You want some? Come here. That's what I thought. Get your hide. You want some? No? Well, okay then. You better shut up. But yeah, Sony Vegas was kind of, uh, didn't like the fact that I was using Minecraft videos for some reason. This is it? Oh, come on. I can find something better, better than that to end it on. Yeah, Sony Vegas didn't like the fact that I was using this type of, uh, format, I guess, I want to say. But, uh, definitely the first video of the set didn't, Sony Vegas didn't want to accept and kept crashing. So I had to render out that video and another video editing thing. Ooh. So that's why the first video looked like that. It was kind of, a uh, slimmed down, so to say. I didn't like doing that, but, uh, it's better than starting over, I guess. What am I so afraid of? If I fall, I'll just, uh... <laughs> I'm still in peaceful mode, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, well, that's a dead end. So hopefully I can, uh, get these videos to, uh... render out properly using Sony Vegas, and Sony Vegas will actually feel like cooperating with me. What's down here? A bunch of coal I don't need. And a dead end. Great. Just felt Minecraft man wanted dead end. Uh, Alright. Let's look over here. Come on. Let's go. Got a cactus up there. Ooh. We go through over here. It's like a pretty promising cave over here. Yeah, this looks pretty promising. Yeah, it just keeps going down. Get some iron over here. Sir, go ahead and mine that out. That's it? Only one? I got zipped. That's it? I came down here. Four... Three... Four... Five pieces of iron. Great. Oh, yeah, that's not all bad. I was hoping it would go down further. Because lately I've been getting pretty lucky with the mines I've been finding. Being these giant, intricate caverns I get lost in all the time. But... Unfortunately, it looks like that's not the case. What the heck? Did I bring this down too? No. Did the fire spread this far? Really? I guess it did, because... <laughs> That's supposed to be a great thing about burning down an entire forest. You can always find your way back by the burning trees. Sorry, cow. Burn down your home. My bad. But yeah, that looks to be about it for this video. Ooh. See, so you just kind of regain your health. Ooh. Ooh. Um, nothing down there. Oh. That looks like a dead end. 
There's some iron. All right, this goes down. Uh, okay, so this is a room. You can know it's a room because it has a ceiling. That's how rooms are defined. There's another way out, I see. Well, this way goes down. Um, sorry, just jumped Ooh. down. This goes on. Uh, looks like that's another way up. Uh, more ways down. This is pretty good. Big room over there. This just keeps leading down, so this might be pretty cool. Um, let's see. So, let's see. Oh! Got some music playing here. I hope this comes out alright on YouTube. Because, uh, I know sometimes the darkness can get pretty bad at times, and you can't see where I'm going. But I can see where I'm going. So don't worry about that. I'm not playing blind here. No matter how dark it gets, you can always see where you're going here. It may not be that way for you, but it is for me. So that's why I'm trying to light more torches so you can see better where I'm going. Uh, jump in a waterfall! Is that another way out? Holy crap, oh! I just looped back on myself. Alright, well, that's, I'm out of torches. Out of torches, out of time, out of luck. Got nothing going right for me. That looks kind of interesting. Huh. Oh, don't throw it that way. Alright, well. Thank you all for viewing this, if you did. Might have to split this into two parts like I did the last time. But, uh, that's going to be a problem. So, anyway, I will see you guys next time. Right? Right, Chicken? We will see them next time? Right? Hey! Come back here! Don't you go hide in your chicken cave! Come back here! Let's... That's what I thought. Alright, see you guys later. Bye.